Hello, my friends. Hola, mis amigos. Today we will read a story about the three little pigs. Hoy vamos a leer la cuenta sobre los tres cerditos. Do you already know the story? ¿Sabes esta historia? All right, my friends. We're going to read the story together. Let's look at the front cover of the book. What do you see on the front cover? That's right. Yo estoy viendo tres cerditos. I see three little pigs. Do you think these pigs are friends? ¿Crees que son amigos? Let's find out. My friends, this is the front cover of the book. If I turn the book around, what is this called? ¿Qué, ¿Cómo se llama esta parte? That's front. That's right. Back cover. And what do we call this? The spine. Una espalda to hold the pages together. Good job, my friends. Let's start reading. Los tres cerditos. The three little pigs. Había una vez tres cerditos que vivían tranquilos y felices. Once there were three little pigs. They lived quiet, happy lives. Let's take a look at the picture of the three little pigs. Mira. Un día vieron un lobo que merodeaba por los alrededores. One day they saw a wolf nearby. Do you see a wolf right there? What do you think the wolf wants to do with the little pigs? ¿Qué quiere hacer este lobo? Do you think he's going to try to eat them? ¿Crees que va a comerlos? Oh my goodness. Tendremos que construir una casa para protegernos del lobo, dijeron los de cerditos. We must build a house for protection, the little pig said. El cerdito pequeño dijo, yo construiré una casa de paja, así la terminaré en un santiamén. The youngest little pig said, I'll build a straw house. That won't take a very long time. Why does he want to build a straw house? ¿Por qué quiere construir una casa de paja? Because he said, well, it's going to be taken, it's going to be really, really fast. So he's trying to make it very, very easy on himself. Do you think he will build a good house from the straw? ¿Crees que va a ser una buena casa de paja? Hmm, let's take, let's find out. El cerdito mediano dijo, la mía será de madera. Eso será pan comido. Tal vez dice que eso será muy fácil. The middle little pig said, I'll build a wooden house. That will be easy to do. So this little pig is, being, is building a wooden house. Do you think that's going to be a good house? He said he's going to do it because that's going to be very easy. Dice que va a construir una casa de madera porque será muy fácil. Hmm. ¿Tú piensas que será buena casa? Y el cerdito mayor decidió que, aunque te tardará más, construirá una casa fuerte y segura. Una casa de piedra. The oldest little pig wanted a strong, safe house, even if it took him a long time. He built a stone house. So what did this pig do? ¿Qué hizo este cerdito? That's right. He said he wants to build a strong house, even if it takes him a long time. Él va a construir una casa um, de fuerte y segura, de piedra. Do you think that's going to be a good house? ¿Tú piensas que será una buena casa? Let's see. Primero, el lobo se acercó a la casa de paja. Sopló y sopló y la casa derribó. First, the wolf went to the straw house. He huffed and he puffed and he blew the house down. So what happened to the straw house? Did it say safe? No, la casa de ribo, the house, was blown away because it was made out of straw. It wasn't a very good house. 
What do you think is going to happen to the next house, the house made of wood? ¿Qué tú piensas que pasará con la casa de madera? Is it going to stay in strong or it's going to be blown away? Let's take a look. Y el cerdito corrió a esconderse en la casa de su hermano mediano. The youngest pig ran to his middle brother's house to hide. Pero después el lobo se dirigió hacia la casa de madera. Una vez allí, sopló y sopló y sopló hasta que la casa derribó. Then the wolf went to the wooden house. He huffed and he puffed and he huffed and he blew the house down. So did the wooden house stand strong? No, my friends. The wooden house was blown away también. También la casa de madera se derribó. Oh my goodness, friends. Do you think he will destroy all the house? Let's find out. Entonces, muertos de miedo, los dos cerditos corrieron a esconderse en la casa de piedra del hermano mayor. The two little pigs were very scared. They ran to their oldest brother to stone house to hide. ¿Cómo se sienten ahora los cerditos? How do they feel? That's right, they said they were very, very scared. Why are they so scared? ¿Por qué tienen miedo? I think so too, my friends. I think they're scared because the wolf will eat them. Yo creo que tienen miedo porque uh, el lobo va a comerlos. Do you think that's going to happen? Finalmente, el lobo fue a la casa de piedra. Sopló y sopló. Sopló y sopló. Pero nada pasó. Finally, the wolf went to the stone house. He huffed and puffed and huffed and puffed. But nothing happened. My friends, why do you think nothing happened this time? ¿Por qué nada pasó esta vez? I think because the house made of stone was very strong. Yo pienso esto pasó porque la casa de piedra, piedra fue muy fuerte. And that's why it's too strong. Do you think the wolf will go away now? ¿Tú, que, ¿Tú piensas que el lobo va a ir ahora y va a dejarlo solo? El lobo astuto quiso entrar por la chimenea, pero fue a parar a una olla. The clever wolf tried to go down the chimney, but he fell into the kettle instead. So my friends, the wolf tried to get in the house, but did he get to the pigs? Mm -mm. He fell into the kettle instead in a very hot water. <gasps> Se cayó a una agua muy, muy, muy caliente. And that's the end. El My fin. friends, which house was standing strongest in the end? ¿Qué casa fue más fuerte que otros en la fin? Sí, tienes razón, la casa de piedra. The stone house, you're absolutely right. Do you think... It was easy for him to build that house. Fue fácil a construirlo? No, it wasn't. No, no será fácil. He took a little bit of time to make it, right, my friends? So I think what we learn from the story is that sometimes it's worth taking your time to make something that is good. A veces vale la pena a tomarse el tiempo para hacer algo bueno. That's it, my friends. This is it for today. My friend Wilfred wants to say bye. Goodbye, my friends.